Hello, Richard Foster here again for the book, Why We Go to the Bathroom. We've been talking about words, and we've been talking about the master scripture, which is guard your heart with all diligence, for out of it are the issues of life, the boundaries of life, the borders of your life. That's Proverbs chapter 4 and verse 23. And you know what defines your life is what comes out of your heart. And what comes out of your heart is what's stored in your heart. And it comes out in the form of words. Words are what end up defining your life. You know, the last time we were talking about at the beginning, God created everything with words. As a matter of fact, in the first chapter of the Gospel of John, it says, In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God, and the same was in the beginning with God. You know, part of what that means is that before God did anything, he designed language. He designed words that would describe every feature of the universe, including every living creature, including man, which he made in his own image. So before God did anything, he designed language, which means he designed words. Words are very powerful things, which just the same way that God designed and created the universe with words, we actually design and create our life, our life path, the boundaries of our life with words. We talked the last time about how death and life are in the power of the tongue. Death and life. There is no middle ground. There aren't words in the middle which have no effect on your life. There are all the words that you speak that have effect on your life. So we need to be very careful with our words. We need to guard what words come into our hearts that we pay attention to, and we need to guard, pay attention to what words come out of our hearts and make corrections where necessary, make corrections to the path of our life by adjusting our words. There is no way I can emphasize enough the importance of words, the power of words, and the fact that God, before he did anything, designed words, and these words designed and created the universe, and the words that we use that come out of our hearts design and create our life. We'll be talking more about this as we go on. Richard Foster again for the book, Why We Go to the Bathroom.